What's up guys, I'm Rosim from RossBarTech.com and today I'm just going to update you on some of the projects that I've been working on. I'm using my uh, GH4 right now to do this video. It's a pretty heavy camera. So without further ado, let me show you around my office slash workstation slash man cave, whatever you want to call it. So I'm just going to turn this camera around. All right, so right there is my, uh, so right there is the famous Dragon Ball Z Goku poster. You've probably seen in a lot of videos. I do love Dragon Ball Z, I love anime, so I, I love the colors, the, the reds, the oranges in this uh, poster, they pop. I also have the same type of reds and oranges in this uh, mouse pad down there, so if, I'm, I'm kind of into like, very bright, vivid colors, especially oranges, reds, and stuff like that. So let's see, right? Down here, I just purchased a Xbox One controller. I don't have an Xbox One. But I purchased an Xbox One controller because I've been playing uh, Battlefront, Star Wars Battlefront, on my uh, PC. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm not a big fan of the keyboard and mouse, so I do have Windows 10, and Windows 10 supports the Xbox One controller, and uh, Star Wars Battlefront it supports uh, the controller as well. If you have a PC version of Star Wars Battlefront, it will support the controller, and you can play the game like you would on an Xbox, so it's pretty cool. It's connected to my PC right there. So this is right here is a Prod Enjoy, my X99 workstation, 4K editing beast of a machine right there. I love this machine. And uh, I got my mouse pad, keyboard, I got some tea right there. I got a Loot Crate box. I haven't done Loot Crate videos in a while, but I might start doing them because I, I do get them all the time. Let's see, right here, this is probably what you guys have been wanting to see for a little bit now. It's my uh, brand new Raspberry Pi 7 Pi super computer cluster that I'm working on. Uh, if you guys have been waiting for this video to come out for this, it, it will come out in the next couple of days. I've been working on it. So if, if you're really uh, eager to see that, just stay tuned. It, it, it will come out. Next to that, I have this uh, Raspberry Pi uh, touchscreen. I don't know what size it is. I did get it from Adafruit. I have a few of them. I will do videos on these touchscreens in the near future. And right here, as you can see, this is my studio lights. I use all three lights in, in the video, so. And let's see what we have over here. Okay, over here is my uh, 3D printing station. I have a computer set up right there. I have my 3D printer. It's my Robo 3D R1 printer right now. Uh, I just purchased a new hot end, the E3D version 6 hot end. I have one installed right now, but it, it's, it broke, so uh, I purchased a new one. As you can see right now, it's just completely dismantled. I will be getting another one tomorrow, so stay tuned for more 3D printing videos. All right, so that's my Raspberry Pi B+. I have a bunch of them laying around. And uh, I use this station also to test out uh, Raspberry Pi, different di distros. I use it for my videos. I have a keyboard and mouse right there. So, All right, guys, I just wanted to do this video to update you guys on what's been going on, show you projects I'm working on, show you a little bit of my workstation here. That's it for this video. If you guys like this video, please give me a like. If you want more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel. I'm Rasim from RossmerTech.com, and thank you for watching.